Welcome to the Raw Room. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, wait, wait, wait. I got to tell y'all something funny, bro. I was on Reddit the other night, just reading through the comments, you know, just seeing what stupid shit somebody might say. Uh-huh. And I saw somebody in the comments say, <laughs> it's not fair that this player, like a player like me, can say, nigga, I was in here and say nigga, he said N-word, but a white right. player can't. Bro, I about lost it. Like, I mean, what? <laughs> That's why I love it. Like, I was just laughing. Hey, I was just hey, now, hey, now this going to fuck you up. You'll get a flag in the CFL for saying that. Bro, I got a flag in 2015. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sarah Thomas. You know, they like they like flag. super nice in Canada, too, bro. You know, they like super nice in Canada. I, 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 I think there's you, like a whole get, bunch of stuff you can't if do. If y'all fight, bro, I bet they kick y'all niggas out for two games. They're not. <laughs> hey, bro. They'll definitely flag your ass for some shit. Hey, yeah. You can't do that, eh? Hey, you can't do go that, eh? The, go back to the tongue, eh? <laughs> can't do that, man. <laughs> nah, yeah, you can't. You can't call nobody a nigga out here, fool. For real, who said nah, it? Man. At least not the Go game. Who said it? I think. Who I said it? I don't. One of the one of the uh, one of my teammates told me that shit. Well, it was at the DBs. They told me that shit for sure. Though you can't you can't call nobody a nigga out there and like during the game, you get a flag or Damn. I don't know, thrown out the game or some shit. You end up yeah, on. You get thrown out, and you end up on <laughs> on, and then you end up on uh, on sportsmanlike videos on YouTube, like Kato saw B. This man one day, bro. <laughs> he even he didn't tell me he told him that. He was like, I saw Darren on on the um on the bad sportsmanship video, and she was like, What you yeah. mean? <laughs> she showed the video. It was the same video of me taking my helmet off and doing this. Now I come back, yeah. and this man told me he at school, bro. <laughs> he running touchdowns and hitting with the phone, doing the same shit. I was like, yeah, yeah man. hey, at least you get your celebration <laughs> down together, brother. Like, like father, you like knew son. you was getting the flag for that, though, bro. Like, you really didn't take your head all the way out. You I mean, it was crazy. already coming out. If you see, like, it was, like, coming up here. <laughs> Yeah, and but then, you can't take it off though. Like it gotta, it gotta come off for it. Not I know. Flag. I was just trying to. Hopefully, they or, just give it to or, me. Or, or you gotta take it off and put it right back on. Like, oh, it's fucked up. Then put it back on. You oh, took yeah, that it, bitch off. Yeah, it was. Yeah, yeah, yeah that was, <laughs> it wasn't gonna be nothing but that. I ain't gonna lie to you. It was probably the smoothest unsportsmanlike like kind of I've seen. Oh, yeah, though. it was <laughs> like it was smooth. Like you hit him, roll, got up, ease, helmet back on. Like, it, like you ain't you didn't miss a beat, bro. I know, <laughs> but that's what I'm saying. Hell. That's why I was like, but you can't give me the penalty for that because it's just like it flowed together. Right, nigga. Man, think about the that. The man dress was was this long. Them hoes babies. <laughs> <laughs> them hoes Them barely touching the back of that nigga neck. Them hoes premature as hell. <laughs> oh yeah, shit. Toddler style. Oh, no yeah. fucking hang time. None, bro. So was he was he was he proud or was he sad? Like, was it like one of those things like, oh my gosh, not there? Or was it like, oh yeah, this this was up. Nah, he, he was, was like, he was probably, oh hell yeah. Yeah, okay. he was probably, this might be shit. calling me and he just answered the phone. I, was, I had to tell him to stop doing this shit. This might just call me and hit you like this on the phone. Like, I answered the phone FaceTime, hit you like this. I bet, bro, stop. Just say what's up, bro. Stop doing this shit. Now <laughs> say, just say what's hey. up. Like, like, hey, now, you, now you ain't gonna... making the shit fun no more, bro. <laughs> now, now, DB, he gonna be a problem. Now you didn't got him stuck. He see you. Uh, he gonna go crazy. I mean, that's cool, but sheesh. <laughs> Damn, he already getting called. It's not even fun no more. That's funny. I'm just saying, dog. But it is funny though that he can. Like, you he, have a gold grill, a gold mouthpiece in, bro. Oh um, nah, I got nah, a couple of them. Holding, I got a grill. Now nah, it's a mouthpiece, but it's a grill though. The whole oh, okay. like molded into shout out, shout out to uh, 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 Mighty Mouth Guards. Uh, that's my dog. Oh, okay. Up in Can- he up in Canada. That's why I get oh, him for. for I've been fucking with him since 2015, 2014. Oh shit, I need to get me one. Yeah, that might be what I'm saying. Yeah. I just he he'll send you the molds and everything. Oh, yeah, yeah, I've been fucking with bro I need for to, what, what's the what's the name again? It's Mighty Mouth Guards. Mighty Mouth Bet. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I've been fucking with bro for a minute. Um I'm trying to my fucking computer is tripping. Anyway. Get your shit together now. Time for new one. I'm just trying to put it on the bitch, like the the, the maximize y'all niggas to keep on going little as hell. I was all good, bro. You ain't got to look at us, fool. Thank you, though. I do appreciate it. That you feel like that you need to look at us. I'm trying to see what the fuck the screen with fake got going on. I'm going to fuck about y'all niggas. 
That's the show. <laughs> <laughs> well, I appreciate the love, bro. I mean, you know, you can just go to my IG to look at me, right, fool. You know what I'm saying? Right, you got my IG page. Hey, all right. Well, uh, <laughs> so, anyways, right. we're getting us a little real hit them up real quick. Starting to think out real early. And, uh, there he is. Is you in the bed, son? To hey, Adam, know, before we get started that? talking about welcome to the raw room, but you are officially on the raw room. Uh, hit him up segment. You in the training room or something? Yay! T.A. Jalen Collins man. is also on the phone. Yay! What's that? What's that, dog? What you got going <laughs> on, my boy? Oh, you in the hotel. You hotel thugging right now, huh? Chilling, man. You know how this life is. Hey, yeah, I'm on the same shit right now. But Thanks. you know, I, I move up to the upper Thanks. room in a couple of days. But uh, ain't going in that. Although, <laughs> but yeah, man, what you got going on, bro? Now, so you just we just were tweeting. Or I just tweeted that <clears throat> that that Atlanta needed canes, and you talking about some hey, hey, hey pumpy breaks. You just got there, like damn. I think that would add some great value to the city of Atlanta. Uh, he on that weak ass hotel Wi Fi, folks. It's Uh-oh. never good. You said Atlanta need what though? I said you that. said they needed a cane, bro. I said Atlanta should get I, a uh, cane. By the way, you said uh, Ugh. yeah. I said Ugh, it's a cane. You think I'm canes a, is trash? I, look, I'm not gonna say cane is trash, but I, I would rather a Whataburger than canes. You rather I'd rather water water a Whataburger than Canes. As a matter of fact, Nashville is about to get a Whataburger soon. I can't wait. You, you know what I'm saying? Whataburger, this Whataburger, Whataburger Auburn, Auburn, I was slick hey. If I was for real, that was one of Auburn? <laughs> it is now. Oh, snap, see? But Canes, mm-hmm. I had a bad experience with Canes. That's the only reason why I can't mess with it. I had Makes like sense. a real bad experience with Canes. And like ever since then, it, it, you know how like it is when like you go to a place for the first time. Yeah. And, then, and that yeah, first time is like a time, bad yeah. time. Yeah. You don't go back after that. And like I had a bad experience with Canes. Matter of fact, it was Vegas. It was you was my in Vegas. Party. I was in Vegas, bro. See, it that's the best I'm on any weekend. I ain't never been at Canes. I've been to the Canes in Vegas. Yeah, I've been to the Canes in Vegas. See, I went so like it was like after the turn up night. Like it was like it was like, like that's what that Canes one is crazy for. night. That's what Canes. And is I for. went, but I mean, but I feel good though. No, I so, mean, but at the same time, like I I've never been to a Canes outside of Louisiana, so I can't really speak for the other Canes. But it was my Louisiana first time outside? having like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah the, the first ones it's, in uh, I don't know Baton where, Rouge. but it was Louisiana. I know that. I think. Yeah. Because every time we play in LSU. Popeyes or Canes? Huh? Which one better, Popeyes or Canes? Be honest. Popeyes, fuck. I ain't gonna lie, I'm a chicken oh, okay. finger nigga. I go with some canes on I mean, but, see, but that's that's all canes <laughs> has. Said, I'm and a that's, chicken finger nigga. And, you, and that's my problem with canes is all it is is ju- is just chicken fingers. But like they gotta the get, sandwich they is just, just chicken fingers on the bun. Be and good and at like, what you do. It's it's good. It is good. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Like, so why they ain't gotta hey they ain't y'all don't need to add no red beans and rice. They don't need to me, add the, you know. Canes was strictly like after we went out, fool. You know what I'm saying? 3 a.m. You it. see the McDonald's or Canes. I'm going to Canes. I ain't gonna lie. Well, nah. I ain't gonna lie. Well, that's if you gonna, yeah, I would eat like that too. If I could pick up Canes or Waffle House, I'm taking Canes. Canes and McDonald's. I was, I'm, I'm, I'm canes. just looking at it, fool. I'm getting this Wait, stomach ache again, bro. Like, you saying. said Canes or Waffle House? I'm taking Canes. Mm, too much tough. bread on it. Too. I mean, I'm, I'm just looking at it, but too much bread on it. Look oh, at it. Nah, nah, dude, see, you talking from outside, Hey, hey, hey. I think you might piss piss some uh, Atlanta people off with that DB Waffle House is uh, a staple out there, goddamn. Now, nah, nah, listen now, now if I'm in Atlanta, now nah, I'm gonna go to Waffle House. <laughs> you in Atlanta? I and you, and you asked for a cane but nah, in but, Atlanta, right? Like, but what that's you doing? in the make a world. We were not in the make a world yet. If we in make a world now, <laughs> all right, damn. I'm gonna it's go to right Canes here. and get just a, a little snack box, and then I'm gonna <laughs> take that hell to Waffle House. And put the hell on my waffle. You know what? This man about to make his own chicken and waffle. Honestly, that's that, that's not a bad idea. You hear me? So that's I'm really showing not. everybody the love. You feel? Me? And I want people to That's just gonna waffle. be a big ass, big ass waffle fool. You said what? I said that's just gonna be a big ass waffle though. Like all that bone chicken and waffle. I mean, that is fine though. That shit sound good as fuck. No, I was thinking. Hey, I was thinking about. Ooh, and you put it in the cane sauce. Ooh. Hey, I was. What's I was the cane thinking, sauce? 
think about this spot. Me and my uh, one of my teammates tried yesterday a chicken and waffle spot out here called the Dirty Bird. Uh-huh. Word? Yeah, it's <laughs> it's crazy, Canada? but right, <laughs> but it's uh, a chicken and waffle spot, and I they had this one uh, had a sandwich. Like a chicken and waffle sandwich. There's waffles on top, you know, chicken covered in some like maple spot. I don't know. This shit was fire though. It was fire. Jalap- jalapenos on Is that. Is it bitch. better than food out some there? Sauce. Have you been to, you been to London, ain't it? To London? Yeah. N- out here? No, no, no. Nah, London, London. Nigga, they talking about out here. Like London, nah, I ain't been in No, nah, I ain't been to London, England. I'm sorry. <laughs> you ain't been? Lie. Yeah, I've been there. They see they food ain't hidden like that. So food I, London is known for like they fishing fishing chips. That shit it? was still fishing nasty. They they, oh, they, they known for like their little London finger foods, ain't it? I think so. Or, or, or hors d'oeuvres. I had I had a buffalo chicken yeah. sandwich from out there, but it, yeah, it wasn't hitting. It wasn't hitting at all. Oh hell no! Like, that bit was I mean, like honestly chicken, though, Bates, the reason why it probably wasn't hitting, man, is because like your taste buds have been like you know. Yeah, poison. processed over the years. I've been poisoned by the American Facts. food system. Facts. Hey, boy, shit. We grew up eating shit. Bro, I remember when the like, food, like, your go to back in the day, bro, was Little Caesars. Hey, the oh. little cheesy, the little cheesy bread. I know that oh, wasn't good, boy. Yeah. There wasn't nothing that good shit about was that. Nothing shit. good about that. It was, <laughs> no, it wasn't, but that <laughs> bitch was busting. Yeah. Little season well busted, bro. All that so, shit yeah, is good I, though. Exactly. Mm-hmm. It's because mm-hmm. it's made like it's it's literally made like in a petri dish, so it can be good. They put all the goodness in it. That shit is fire though. Like that little zesty cheesy bread. Oh my god. That's what I'm saying. Like who? I don't know, man. Then they really fucked up the game with the uh, hot and ready. They 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 fucked. But the them hoes so garbage that. now. Hey, but them hoes so trash food. But the nigga go get one. Hey, not shit, go not get now, me. though. That shit garbage, garbage. No, no. Now, hell no. Back in the day, yeah. I ain't been in a minute. I'm, I'm pretty sure they done up their formula a little bit. Like, they got like a little deep dish hot and ready. Sweet. Now. Sweet. No, don't nah. be fooled now. Don't be fooled. Okay, that's the internet. Yeah, nah. That's the internet. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's production right there. We didn't talk about that on here. That's production right there. Yeah, they. Yeah, you right. Like, they, they, they put like some little baby oil on it and make it look shiny. Beef <laughs> yeah, it up see, a little bit. That shit. That little fake. season's not hitting on Nigga shit. just sprinkle garlic salt on that shit, bro. <laughs> Try to call your man's back, man. Yeah, get this nigga Wi Fi right. Nah, I'm trying to talk. Ain't no calling somebody else. This nigga ain't answering either. Oh, uh, shit. It be like that. Niggas ain't shit. It's Tuesday. I know what the nigga. fuck y'all niggas doing. Nothing. Off day. Yeah. Silly boys. All right. <laughs> Anyways, let <laughs> me say silly boys. Uh, Cause I be talking to Kato, I just be like, yeah, you're a silly boy. He be like, you know, some dad shit, man. Anyways, move on. Uh, <laughs> I'm just not realizing from looking at the bird ladies' IG uh, mm-hmm. that <laughs> the Saints. I mean, I should have known over the years, you know, just watching. But the Saints and the Falcons are a big rivalry. You know, they should. Really? You should have been doing this. I mean, I should have been known, but I'm not. I never been involved with the the, the division oh, that's, any type. Division of rivalry, go, I guess. Yeah, that yeah. That shit go crazy. But it go up like nah, for real. Like they already down there on, on Bourbon Street with a sign that say Peace Tree Street. <laughs> like them, oh yeah. And folks ain't joking. You know what I'm saying? They taking over. They already yeah, time go down there taking over, and this, so I'm just now realizing that the rivalry that that has been between New Orleans and Atlanta as far as these two teams, it, it's it go back, you know, since since the beginning, you know, like every other rivalry. But it's cool to see that, you know, different places. You know, I'm thinking about all the places that have rivalries, like the Rams and the Seahawks, or you know, Rams and and Niners, or in Oakland. It was I feel Denver like uh, New City. Orleans and Atlanta is just like a dope ass rivalry anywhere because those are two hella black cities. That ain't got like nothing to do with black as hell. But I'm saying, but and they, New Orleans they is black as hell. But that ain't got nothing to do with it, though. It's just like Tennessee really and Indianapolis it, and Tennessee and Jacksonville. It has nothing to do with it. It just has the fact that organization-wise, like, the fans in Tennessee can't stand Jacksonville. They, like, just can't stand anything about Jacksonville, 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 just anything. But... FaceTime video. Hold on. Young Hefe. Jeffrey Simmons. Bro, 
Like, why is you looking at the phone like that, bro? Welcome, bro. You are all in the raw room, but what's good, bro? Why is you why are you looking like that, bro? Get the you sadness. I know Derek is gone, but it's hey, it's okay. It's your turn now. <laughs> what's up with you, bro? How you doing, uh, man? man? I ain't seen my dog in a minute, bro. Man, you ain't the funny and shit, man. You in Atlanta and shit. Oh, he's talking about acting oh, funny. Wow. Nigga, you act like that got something to do with not bringing your boy back. But then, hey, that's for another day, another conversation. I'm just calling to see what you got going on, man. See how you doing, big dog. No, I'm good, man. Just, you know, regular shit, sorting it out to the game. Just trying to, you know, maintain. Yeah, yeah. You ain't doing no jumping around over there, throwing up no cues and shit, huh? Ain't no dancing going on no more. <laughs> What time? Hell nah. Big battle. Hey, now I didn't get to see y'all game. Y'all wish I was down and came back. Man, I think we were what, down 14. Ooh. I, said, well, you know, I mean, you've you been in that stadium before. You know how yeah, that shit They had the roof open. We started off, we started off slow. They Eventually had, walked back up. They had that roof open? Man, yeah. Oh, I know that bill was cold. Hell, oh, shit. Yeah. It, wasn't, it, wasn't that, it, wasn't, it wasn't that bad. It just, you know, that sunlight was beaming that in. Beam, so. Yeah, that sun be beaming like a trash ass garage. Like, yeah. Huh? I said, yeah, that sun be beaming through that little garage though. They be having that shit weak as hell. But yeah, that man, I was just calling to see what you had going on, man. See what you were doing, man. See you taking care of your body on this Tuesday. Your phone was breaking up. What'd you say? I said, I just seen what you had going on. See, making sure you're taking care of your body on this fine Tuesday. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. I'm geared to walk into I'm out of to walk into this spot to get in the cryo uh, chamber. Ooh, see, hey, if you Ooh, come on that. over here to the Falcon, baby, we got one at the facility. You ain't got to do all that shit. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, hey. Hey, are you on the front now? Hey, I'm just hey, you know what I'm saying? You know, I got to jump you're over the switch. Different. I had to jump over the tracks, man, and switch team. You feel me? Hey. But shit, hit me up, bro. Fuck with me. All right, bro. Easy. Yeah. They cryo at the facility. That shit, lovely. Nigga was nigga was so happy when they put that that bitch in, fool. Bro, I, I was in that, that bitch shit. every day, fool. After practice, but I'm sorry. I do this, so I do it every Friday. I do um, Tuesdays. I mean Wednesday, and Thursday. I get. I do the uh, you know uh, what's the contrast. So I do um, like probably yeah. eight nine minutes total to back and forth with the. Hot and cold. Yeah. And then on Friday, I just hit a whole three, three and a half and one song, put on one song, goddamn, and just get in that bitch and just t- walk in the circle, nigga, until that shit cut off. <laughs> I'll be, 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 be in that bitch standing still, fool. Oh, no, nah, I can't stand still, bro, because then I be, I think it, I start my breathing. I start thinking about my breathing, then nigga start hyperventilating in that bitch. Oh, hell, this nigga did. Man, when I first got in that giant, bro. When I first got in, I've been in one before. But this one was, first of all, bigger. Yeah. I ain't never been in one that big. Been one like half that size. So when I got in that bitch, I'm like, okay, this bitch big. But I like, get so much, uh, I don't even know what you call it. Like, like the little the smoke, the fog and shit. Like, so I'm yeah, breathing. The gas. Yeah, I'm breathing and breathing that shit in. And I'm trying to figure out, okay, am I going to go through my nose and my mouth? And, you know, <laughs> how I'm going to do this? And then I, saw, I had that mask on and shit. So I'm like, ah, fuck. So I then I just, nigga Darren, I just took the towel line. I just took the towel and just wrapped that bitch around my whole face. Just kept my eyes out. Then I could just be able to uh, filter the, the, the shit coming in and out. Then I just walked that bitch in a circle, bro. I was like, oh, hell hey. no. So that's what I do every time to wrap that shit around my face. I mean, how long, how long do you stay in those machines, bro? It's just three minutes. I, 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 can, I've like never some done them, Most of them, they tell you you can't do no more than like three, three and a half minutes. Yeah, it's so like, like you know what I mean, bro? Like, we like old school, bro. Like, we it was like a big ass garbage can with yeah, ice. Yeah, ice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some, ice, ice, man, nah, some niggas still do that, too. Some folks do. I am not an ice bath. Yeah, man. I ain't an no ice guy. I'm definitely not an ice guy. But uh, mm, fuck it. I also learned that uh, Arthur Blank don't he get right in front of that music and let that bitch go. <laughs> I know he deaf. I know he. he, he about, I know he about deaf. Fool. He be sitting right. He been he sitting in front be. of that speaker since I was there. Right. First of all, right somebody, in front of the speaker some, too. First of all, one of my linebacker coach had told me he was like, "Hey, he was like you saying Arthur? Uh, he was like you saying Arthur Blank yet?" And I was like, yeah, "He just came through to everybody up." He was like, "Yeah, yeah, just wait right before the game." I was like, what do you mean? He was like, just watch him. 
He be man. sitting right and he be he be he vibing. He be sitting right there. I'm talking in the middle of that bitch. You looking dead straight ahead, Chuck. <laughs> now, you don't think that man ain't finna go to war, bro. That shit hey, hilarious, dog. No idea what's going through that man's head. Oh, nah, nah, he not be, one clue. He don't, he don't even know what he got going on. <laughs> right. He be in that bitch just zoned out, fool. Yeah, yeah. And hey, he a solid killer, fool. You better watch out. Yeah, he, you can tell <laughs> hey, he knows a little something. Exactly. Arthur ain't playing. Yeah, for sure. Arthur. Arthur! Hey, but uh, speaking of NBA niggas and shit, shout out, like we said, shout out to John Moran his thousand career assists. Um, That's a lie. Which of uh, them NBA... Okay, what is the NBA? Let me see them NBA City jerseys that, that we talking about right here. Oh, man. I seen it. My buddy sent me the tweet yesterday. Some of these hoes Pull them trash. Up. I mean, Miami sure got the best one again, bro. Like, so. Miami can't lose with kind of jerseys. Like, all their jerseys be dope. I was about to say, my, Miami is easily in top, top three. Yeah, all the time. Like, their Miami joint go, go hard. I like, I like the Miami the, joint. I like the Miami joint. The Raptors. Like, the Raptors always yeah, go Raptors hard. Raptors always be hard. I and like I like, the Mavs. I like, uh, is that the Phoenix. Mavs? Yeah, not the Timberwolves. I like Timberwolves shit. I like the Nets shit. But check this out. I'm pretty sure, like, yeah. I just learned this. And, like, maybe I should have known, bro. But... So, you know, Utah Jazz, right? Yeah. You know, they were originally in New Orleans. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I did not know that. Hey, yeah. You too, yeah, baby. <laughs> but, and like, I was, I'm was, i over thinking in my head, like, damn, that, that does make sense, because why the hell is Utah Jazz, Jazz yeah. the Jazz? Yeah, it's like, yeah, yeah. They just don't play There's a whole jazz thing on YouTube that talk about, like, the whole evolution of how, like, all the first NBA team and how, like, all the way up to now. Like, they talk about the Grizzlies mm -hmm. move from Vancouver. Yeah, they don't, you know, who knew that shit? Yeah, you know I'm saying, but like you know, you ain't know like about that though. You know, what I'm saying? shit like that. Yeah, and like yeah. Toronto and how they got the name Raptors and just as a whole bunch of crazy shit. Right? How did Toronto get the name Raptors? I gotta yeah, know. I don't even remember. You I don't even watch that bitch. I don't, don't even make no sense. Asking the wrong person. I think. Bro, like you went Toronto. You should know. It's a fan. Walk vote. around. No, ask somebody. I shouldn't know. I'm not from Toronto. I'm but speaking of Toronto, like y'all finna be in the playoffs though. Y'all finna be in the playoffs though. No, yeah, we is in, we is in the playoffs though. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now yeah. it's live. Now nah, it's the playoffs weird the playoff. as hell, like like everything else. No, <laughs> is, it like, is it like a best out of three over that bitch? So, <laughs> nah, <laughs> nah, nah, got nah. series. <laughs> hey, nah, got this, series this in football. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> the, the playoffs about one of the the most normal things. But you know what I'm saying? If you went first, then you get a bye, uh -huh. and then you know what I'm saying? You went you went two games, you got a championship. I think it's. Uh, I mean, it's only eight teams, so it's. You know what I'm saying? The first round, the second round, and then the last game. Okay. Okay. Yeah, what y'all so looking like then, bro? Like y'all, y'all, y'all seeding and everything. Are, are you like are y'all one? I mean, how do Oh yeah, like? yeah. Right. Right now we won in the East. Um okay. so and then I guess like the power rankings and stuff. I guess we got the the second best record in the league. So the only team, the only shit, Winnipeg, they only lost one game, and that's to to us. Well, earlier in the year, they lost, yeah, they lost us. Okay. But yeah, so shit, we I mean, we went out. We got our away game this week, man. We went out and we all play it. Uh in Ottawa. Do y'all get the, to go the, like on dinners and shit? Blacks. Like, 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 you know how you know the night before. Wait, say that again. Do y'all don't ever go to dinners or anything? <clears throat> like, do anybody do that? Like, you know how like in the league, you know, on Saturday, oh, yeah, 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 like, yeah. and shit. Yeah, no, nah, I mean it's it's a it's a little looser. Well, it's a lot it's a lot looser. I mean, we got we got like meetings the night before mm -hmm. and stuff like that. Um, and then depend on like what time we play. Um, I mean, you just they give it they give us per diem, you know what I'm saying, for food and stuff mm -hmm. like that. And then, you know, you go grab your food on your own type shit. You know what I'm saying? You can go with your with your boys or do whatever you want, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. It ain't really ain't really like no it ain't super strict. Ain't like, on, like, set, you gotta like, do this. Right, this at you this gotta, time, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It ain't really, you know. I mean, I got, got no curfew. curfew got and shit. No, yeah, we we got we oh, got okay. a curfew, got curfew, but it ain't. But it ain't like that's. They ain't, are they even checking? Huh? Do they even check? I mean, I don't know. I was in the room. I ain't. I don't know. I don't, I ain't worried about <laughs> that because I'm sure. Look, I was in the room. Goddamn it! <laughs> I don't know what I don't know what everybody else was doing, but I was I was there. I was in the room. I ain't pulling. I ain't pulling no DB. Got to call the nigga. Hey, uh, you know what I'm saying? Uh, Knocking, concussed and shit. 
Uh, so <laughs> not no Ray Ray. <laughs> trying trying to make bed check and shit. Nah, Ray right, Ray. But no, it's it's cool, fool. I mean, you know, you just little little freedom, do what you want. Yeah. 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 And then yeah, so I mean shit, shit is shit is loose out here, but you gotta be a professional. So but I know <clears throat> is it like is it like uh I know they, you know, they 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 love their Toronto rappers out there. And that's why I see the heating up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is it getting like I know it's, it's, it's since it's playoff time for y'all, right. are they starting to be more into basketball time of that, especially since it's getting colder. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Do y'all do y'all still get y'all love and y'all still get y'all like the fans still so, into it and since y'all getting that playoff push? Right. Uh I mean, we're gonna see how it's looking, but like I guess recently, you know. Hasn't haven't had the best seasons here and stuff like that, but mm, mm. I know it's so much to do in this city. Like you said, the games, like they got a yeah. soccer game, uh, Toronto FC. They got a, a game of what today or tomorrow, one of the okay. two. But like it's so much, so much other stuff going on, and I guess not a lot of people, even people from Canada, don't really know all about you know yeah, CFL and stuff like that. Yeah, oh, you know well, what I'm yeah, saying? That but too, that is true. Cause it's hockey. Right, but it, there, oh, I was about to say y'all got a a, a hockey because it's hockey season too, ain't it? Right, right, right. So it's everything yeah. going on, but it's like of course the more we win, you know what I'm saying, the more yeah. people go on yeah. you know and shit. I mean once they get to the playoffs and shit like that, mm-hmm. we playing home games, of course them folks are gonna come and show up to the game. How could yeah. they not like it's, it's playoffs. Ain't nobody playing so shit. Bro, did I see that one dude had on a hoodie jersey? Yeah, you know, uh, probably yeah. Some dudes probably old, out there, bro. You don't know nothing about yeah. the swag that's going on in football these days, bro. Yeah, football. They, they been that doing is not that a hoodie jersey. Like, he just got a hoodie on that just cut. Uh, yeah, he put a hoodie on under there. Niggas in the league been stopped doing that years ago. <laughs> no, yeah, you can't do that. You like, can't man, do I was about to say, now. I don't think you can do right. that. Now nah, we used to grab man, a hoodie. I did. I did. We played Kansas City with one cold ass night on Thursday. Nigga, yeah. I had a hoodie on no sleeves, but a thick ass hoodie. With the hood fine. on that bitch and play. Fine. Nah, that was yeah. before the fine. Next oh, before the fine? Yeah. Next, I mean, I oh, ain't okay. like that shit no way. Cause I felt like oh, I was a oh, they turtle saw in that bitch. Bro, we played, we won overtime this past week. I, I'm just watching the clips, bro. The shit was crazy. It was, it was raining crazy. out there, huh? It was cold rain. It was, it was a little see, well, see, It's been raining out here, but it's not like it's not like raining in the south where to pour down. It's like raining out here, it's like Seattle. drizzling. Constantly, yeah. kind of, yeah, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Windy, cold, and shit. But no, nah, like, the shit was crazy, bro. Cause we, you know, at the end of the game, it's probably like, I don't know, under 10 seconds left on the clock, you know, enough time for them to kick a field goal, right? Mm. <clears throat> we up by a point. They kick a field goal. I turn around. That bitch will whew, right past the upright. I'm like, okay, he missed that bitch. Game over. No, that bitch went Somebody out the back. Of the, no, it went out the back of the end zone. And they got a point. So we had to go to overtime. I said, what the fuck? <laughs> what? <laughs> Bro, no, listen. So so if he kicked the field goal, right, and it go out the back of the end zone, uh-huh. he missed it, and it go out the back of the end zone, it's a point for them. And I think, like, on the punt that we had scored on, like, on the, oh on my the first God. game, I think if they, if they, miss, if they miss the field goal, it's and one it point. Stays in, oh, if it, it stays, stays in, in the end zone, no, no, I know if they miss the field goal and it stays in the end zone, like in the field of play, they can recover that. I think for like a touchdown <laughs> or some shit. Yeah, you should create some crazy shit for like. And, and if he miss it and they go out, he get one point. <laughs> right, get, but this is insane, bro. The rule, the rules is wild. Like we had a whole, bro. We had a whole. Uh, we was about to bring the kickout team. Like at the end of the game, the or towards team. the end of the game, the kick out, like it's a situation where I told you they punt it, try to yeah, punt it into the end zone yeah. to get a point. And we we was about to have to do that. I was like, bro, this shit really crazy. And then overtime, you got to go for two. Ain't no, ain't no field goals. None of that shit. But you know, this is, I got to ask one question. This is, hold on, wait, quick, wait, wait, wait. This is go recess ahead. football at a pro level. Hell player. yeah. Bro, and it's 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 really exciting if you watch the game. Like shit go, it go quick and it's this really is exciting. Crazy. But the rules is crazy, fool. This is what I gotta ask you, bro, as a DB, bro. Uh-huh. Having the goalposts right in front of the line. 
<laughs> they yeah. use it as a pick sometimes. Like you gotta like like no, nah, it did. Like, I don't <laughs> I don't like I guess I've never we haven't really had a situation where I'm like crossing, you know what I'm saying? Cause I'm the corner, because I'm I'm way on the outside. Like I mean, I, I know it does on happen. My side of the ball. <laughs> Right, I I haven't I haven't experienced that yet. But, that shit uh, look sure dangerous it, as hell. No, it, it dangerous, do, fool. Cause you, cause you could just turn around, <laughs> run in right into that bitch, fool. I'm sure niggas have done it. Oh yeah, we gotta find them clips. I know for a fact but some people like, got you know, laid but, out but, by that like, goalpost. You know, just back in the day, the NFL had the same shit. No, yeah, I do remember that. So that's what I'm saying. So plenty of clips of niggas busting their ass in there. Yeah, that's what it was like. Nah, we we getting too many niggas hurt. We gotta move. That, that I ain't gonna lie, bro. How did that even make sense? See, but no, be the crazy thing yeah. is back in the day, yeah, it, was two, it was Look at two lane, fucking, fool. it was Boom. two poles. Two fool. poles, Look at that. bro. That's dumb as hell. Two poles, Not fool. one, but two. <laughs> you gonna miss this first one? Second, got your ass. <laughs> Facts, like what? <laughs> that big Oh, I dodged that one. Pop. That hoe looks nah, strong fool. and shit, too. I'd be oh. sick as fuck if I, if I catch a pass, oh, fool, turn around and smack that fucking thing, fool. I'd be <sighs> sick as hell. I'm hot. I'm what hot is, at the it, coach. I'm hot at the quarterback. I'm hot at the nigga that thought about this shit. That put the, the hey, league. Think, nigga, everybody. <laughs> think about, was think about, I just, I'm think about this home, shit, fool. You think about this shit. You think about if you running a dig last play of the game. You got they running a slant on dig. You trying to oh your quarterback throwing that whole Johnny United throw that bitch to his receiver and bing yeah. off the fucking goalpost. Yeah, or so or or the nigga catch the bitch and then hit the goalpost and drop yeah, the ball. The ball. I'd be <laughs> sick. They I'd call be the fucking fumble. sick. Oh, that shit. Ooh, that shit wait, crazy. He hurt. He yeah, hurt. he he hurt. That's no. The receiver I mean, and bro. the receiver gotta be laughing like, oh boy. <laughs> hey, you gotta hey. keep your head on the swivel, my nigga. Know where right, you Why at, you didn't think I want for the ball, buddy? <laughs> man, what well, you was wide open for a reason. <laughs> <laughs> that shit Boy, crazy. You think I let you do that, buddy. Full yeah, speed, I mean, DB. Yeah, he was full, full speed. speed. Foul. Boom. You I mean, think? he got a pad on it, but still, fool. That pad ain't help shit. I, I Nothing, help a little bro. bit. Help a that's, little bit. that's some serious whiplash, my nigga. Slick the quarterback green for throwing it right there. Nah, that was he or DB. <laughs> set that nigga up, fool. He was a DB. The receiver set his ass up. The receiver yeah, just that's said, what fuck it. Was. it. I ain't catching this ball. You catch. He said, "Yeah, it's, it ain't it ain't gonna be a fucking catchable ball. I'm gonna just run this nigga into the goalpost. Fuck it. That's green. Yeah. Hey, but uh, right now, Auburn basketball, bro, is on some other shit. I don't know. If Bruce Pearl pumped his goddamn basketball steroids into this whole campaign, this whole program, but he getting four stars, five stars all across the country right now. Already, I mean, well, already they've been doing that, but." They got yeah. him talking about for next year, not even this season, for that next season. He already got that going. Uh, some four star Westerly, but other than that, this big C, it's a big season for them boys. They had a little kickoff game the other night at the Auburn Arena. Um, mm -hmm. you know, my times I remember Auburn Arena basketball arena. It was probably fifty people in there. You know, the empty as hell. Damn. Oh, oh man. Basketball team was not great. Shout my nigga KG, keep Gable. You was cold as fuck. Yeah, you know that nigga still hooping to this day. But go ahead and go up 10, 10 spots though. See what's going on. But we talking about go up ten spots. Go up ten spots. Go up ten spots. Uh, they only what, in the what, ranking. What I don't yeah. even know what they starting off. Auburn's twenty two. I'm saying Memphis up there they, twelve. Auburn at 22. <laughs> okay, well, yeah. Okay, can you relax down? Overly aggressive bad, ass who? nigga. We are Auburn Tigers first. Right. Who, who are we? We, I mean, he, me he and most Auburn of the Tiger. I get, I get, I get what he's saying, but like, okay. That's what I'm just yeah. saying. I'm just saying most. Bro, you are a Tiger basketball player first. I know Tiger, both Tigers. I was getting to. Don't but you, you see, are. If you, don't you look at the notes Tiger right there? You looking at the notes right now, and you can see what's right under the Auburn basketball. I don't see nothing. Auburn, Memphis my basketball. My that's my what bad. they say. Right my there. bad. My fault. My fault. Go ahead. Go ahead. Hey, I know I didn't start at quarterback that last game at Olive Branch, but hey, Todd was about to come out. I was about to go in. Yeah, let, me, let me just work this thing. All right. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> go ahead. Keep me, go ahead. Keep me warm. You got, fuck, you got it. Nigga, my bad. You just fucked me up. I ain't know what the fuck I was talking about no more. 
Fuck. Oh, Bruce yeah. Pearl to go. Uh, Bruce God, Pearl, bro. Uh, pumping steroids, getting the recruits in. Boys looking good. Go ahead. No, nah, he just get the, he just getting the thing. I'm just ready to see them boys hoop. You know, and plus, but college basketball is slick, boring. Uh, it's almost like college Bruh, football. I don't know how niggas watch that shit. So I'm just ready to see them. Um, you know, when tourney play start, and, and I'll see them in March. That's the only thing people watch. Bro. <laughs> February. I'll start for real for January, February. Because that's when March football Madden. over with. So January, February, that's, you know, basketball picking up for everybody. High right. school and shit, everybody getting hot. So, you know what I'm saying? We'll the SEC, it. though, I ain't gonna lie to you. Like, I feel like the SEC, as far as, like, their basketball programs go, they've been getting a better and better. I mean, obviously, you have oh, yeah, they like, getting better. I mean... Man, like the SEC really like I, I'm not sure what they trying to do. I think they they, they try to take over sports in general, but they yeah, definitely right. like you know picked up in, in basketball for sure. No, I will agree. They have gotten better over the yeah. They've gotten a lot better over the years. A lot mm-hmm. better. Uh-huh. Back in the day, it was just Kentucky. I mean, I was about to say like, yeah, Tennessee, Col- 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 Tennessee was straight for a while. Yeah, Man, collectively. Like, collectively though, like it's like yeah, a conference nah. that you know what I'm saying. It was, they actually doing pick, their thing. The guy picking got up a little bit. Because Auburn basketball was not it. But I, I'm i lying. The, you know, like you said, Memphis coming in number 12 this year, mm-hmm. bro. I yeah. just want to see what Penny and mm-hmm. them boys talking about. I know they've had their little game. What they play Lane? What they play Lane and, uh, yeah. And, um, they played, uh, Lamar and mm-hmm. yeah. yeah. Memphis shit. Nobody. Yeah, yeah Memphis shit. You know, the two schools they yeah. always yeah. supposed to play. And, this, and they Jalen Duran like though, boy, I think he gonna be that guy. Who I like, Jalen Duran. Jalen Duran, I like Jalen Duran. I like all. Hey, I like the whole fucking team. Of course, yeah, I mean, yeah, they, the nigga last they, name. Well, yeah, nah, they they do got a nice little team. So. They got a squad and they young, bro. Yeah, boy, that's young. hey. The young Coopers is really different. I don't matter. Hey, Tyler I thought they was so dope, Tyler though. Harris back in Memphis. Dang, I ain't know that. Oh, yeah, I did. Ah, but what you said, sweet? I, I, I was about to say, uh, so uh, low max, bro. That man jersey, so you know, that man got the ten on there. They yeah, so they say ten, 10 on it. Yeah. I thought that she was so fresh. Okay, yeah. I'm, but how I'm like though, did we just think about that? Because I'm sure a nigga had on them ten before <laughs> this. Ain't nobody ever. Wore I 10? mean, like he's <laughs> he's had the ten on, but like somebody just put it on out there on, on the on the. I, no, no, what? It, he was two. He was two. He was. Two, no, man. listen, I'm saying this. Who and I'm saying. I know we haven't had no player that we realized like or we recognize as you know his as caliber as a that was wearing number ten out there who would think about him. Nigga was wearing number two, Dwan Wagner. He was wearing thirty five. No, who was Darius Washington? That nigga was coded for he won thirty five. Yeah, yeah thirty five. Dwan Wagner wearing two. Uh Lorenzo Wright, well he was wearing forty something, twenty something, whatever fuck. What to see, you feel me? Like it was all these folks wearing different numbers. Nobody ever put the different. ten just right under that. Nobody put a ten on. In Derek, Rose, well, he wasn't even from Memphis, but still. Yeah, he mm-hmm. had 23. Right. D. Rose mm-hmm. did. So Let nobody. See. Rodney, Rodney Carney Hunt. had 10. Rodney, Rodney Carney had 10. Rodney Carney did have 10. Yeah, he had 10. He I'm trying 10. to think now. Who else? And Carney was that guy. Rodney Carney too, was the guy. That boy had some, yeah. some socks. Where you Bunnies. Said. Bunny, yeah, man. bro, socks. Sure. Yeah, he had bunnies. socks long as hell. Ooh, remember yes, Memphis sir. had them black jerseys? Ooh, hell yeah! I remember them hoes. Them hoes was hard. Ooh, who was out his... on this squad with Rodney Carney? Was uh, what year was that though? His squad, bro. I got got his socks up like he playing football, bro. I'm trying to think, but yeah, uh, that man wore his socks incredibly unnecessarily yeah. too high. And he them look like this is middle school. And them hoes rolled at the knee too. So it was, was like, yeah. it was like the they middle school jamboree socks, fool. <laughs> like, they might have some thigh highs, fool. <laughs> Fuck them. <laughs> they got stockings on. What's going on, fool? Get up and back around the corner. Hold man. on, what year he was at Memphis? Hold on, hold on. Wait, it had to be, it had to be 06, 05, 06. He got that 03 to 04. So the 03 to 04. 03 to 04. 2003. We'll just say Memphis basketball. 06. He was drafted in 2006. Okay, he was drafted in 06. Drafted in 06, but he was on that. He was on the squad though. That 03 or 04. Yeah, I feel like he was on the squad. I feel like they had Sean Banks. He went to lead. Uh, Antonio Burks, Anthony Rice, Jeremy Hunt, my dog, Dewan Irwin, Ivan Lopez. I remember that man. Arthur Barkley, Billy Richman. I don't know none of them. Oh, yeah, I, see, I know every, yeah, everybody I know my name right now. Yeah, hell yeah. I know everybody he naming right now. Hell yeah. 
I don't know nobody. That's when that's when uh, Kyle Perry started getting a boy from Jersey and shit. Yeah, well, I remember. Yeah. I remember Joey Dorsey. Yeah, <laughs> that Andre was Alex. up uh, years later. Joey Dorsey. That was like an 06. Yeah, remember the same time. Shout some Tigers though, man, bro. Shout I'm, I'm looking forward Tigers, to seeing. Man. Hell yeah, and they got one of the best basketball courts uh, in the in the college basketball. That shit fresh as hell. Fact, hundred percent fresh as hell. Hell yeah. Coaching style looking good. You got Brown sitting Ooh, down on the Willie bench. Willie Kemp, Donnell Mack, Pierre Niles, bro. You know yeah. Pierre, Pierre Niles? Okay, I know, I know them. That's big right there. Uh, I know Joey them names. Joey Dorsey, CDR. Damn, what that. number did Pierre wear? That man wore like number one or something. Pierre yeah, he had number one, one fool. Yeah, number one, one fool. That was stretched out, boy. The biggest dude on the court had number one out yeah. there, bro. Pierre was crazy. wore Andre he was a big ass Antonio dude. Anderson. Uh... Chance McGrady, remember that nigga? Yeah, I remember Chance McGrady. Uh, sure do. Sean Tagger, I used to like that nigga. How he was Clyde Sean Wade, was nice. Clyde Wade, man for finals. Hell yeah, that was a squad, bro. Bro, somebody put on Twitter. Uh, I'm not. It was ESPN. It was on Halloween, and they was like, um, the question was like, uh, like what is like one sports moment that still hunts you to this day or whatever. Shh, come on, and man. I knew what. I knew which oh, one I was thinking of. So I just, I wasn't going to say nothing. I was just going to scroll through the comments. And Derek Poston said, he didn't say nothing. He just, he just posted that shot with a Mario Chalmers running championship. I said, bro, why you got to do that for? Man, like, man, I already yeah. knew what it was going to be. Man, but that was the one. I cried. Man, to this day. I was, I was 17, day. That one right there. That's the picture. Bro, I cried, bro. Them folks. We all cried. I cried. We all cried. Man, bro, bro I say the whole school was so sad the next day, bro. Yeah, I knew everybody. Everybody was sick when that shit happened. I didn't really care, but I was like, "Damn, fool, Memphis." Okay, we everybody going sad. for Memphis. I guess I'll cheer for them niggas. But damn, we were sad. Man, that shit hurt the city right there. Mario Chalmers. Yeah, I was, this, I was, this is for you, Mario Chalmers, bro. You know you could have stopped a lot of violence in Memphis. A lot of violence. Man, what <laughs> Memphis would have been, 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 been a much better place. We ain't been the same. Much better place. But for those those couple days in March. We was a peaceful city. It was a mm-hmm. peaceful city, man. Everybody mm-hmm. hugged everybody. Mm-hmm. Everybody honking home. Go Tigers, go! It was so in harmony, bro. Yo ass. You soon as, soon as, as soon as the game was over. It was, a, it was it was the MLK assassination and that. <laughs> and that. Yep. No cap, bro. Yep. That was the that's the worst two worst things that ever happened to the city of Memphis. MLK assassination and fucking and Mario that. Chalmers. My yeah, that's yep. crazy. And What's I'm, the nigga that ain't that killed my um, MLK? I don't know. Some white racist dude. Yeah, him and Mario Thomas is the same person. <laughs> me, yeah. they the same nah, person. Wow. I, I, I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> <laughs> no, I wouldn't say that, DB. I won't go that far. I won't go that far. <laughs> he hurt the city, boo. He hurt. <laughs> I won't go that far, but yeah, you know. Yeah, Mario. I feel what you say. Fucking Mario. But did you know that a woman uh <laughs> sued her boyfriend for not proposing to her after eight years? I was like, well, how on how can you do that? Cause I know bro, growing up, you know, playing them motherfuckers that were living together and they just was living together. Damn, why do they look sad for? <laughs> <laughs> nah, I don't, what the fuck? I don't, I, that can't be the same. So all right, I got here some particulars. So like I mean, like what happened? Like I don't, I don't, I don't get it. I, I, I didn't know. Like a it's, woman, it's, it's, yeah, I, I like what? Right there. Gertrude. Yeah, I, first of all, you uh, shouldn't uh, fuck with no one named Gertrude. And then Gertrude. It's Ain't nobody 20, asked for 1818 named Gertrude. My, what? That was where you fucking blew right, it, let's buddy. See. Let's see. Gertrude, 26. Herbert, 28. They're both horrible names. Share child. Um, <laughs> oh, they got a kid together. Uh, Maybe it's some child support type stuff. He promised to he promised to propose. Now see that's what she okay. went wrong. You can't okay. expect that because you get a baby by somebody that they they they, they, they gonna propose to you now. That don't mean nothing. I have a now it's like a question of do you even did you really want the kid? Yeah. Wait, I hold on. The what the fuck? I'm just reading this shit, bro. I mean Yeah, same. I I, I don't mean, y'all, I don't, y'all know I don't, we got I don't people that's listening, it, so you can't just read it to yourself. Like, no, I, share I mean, what the I, fuck you reading for the people. It just don't make sense. That's what it I'm don't saying. Make sense so that's how she's we in... all hear it. Feeling tired okay, of first said... day to her and other have uh, have lacks of, of official commitment. Gertrude decided to take her bow 
to court and sue him for wasting her time after he failed to deliver on the happy ever after she was waiting for him. I Lose just want to know, like, what was... felt as though the father of her child was not serious enough for the relationship, despite the fact he paid the dowry payment to her family. As a tradition in the native Zambia, he had. Ah, See, that's the thing right okay. there. See, if okay. y'all put that shit out there so the people can hear it, then we all can get this shit figured out. Sense. It's a whole <laughs> other country that we ain't got no, we don't know what okay. their rules is, what their laws okay. are. Okay, this makes on, sense. Me, so, like, there are these see. countries, like, over, like, in Africa that. and, like, uh, and overseas where, go. like, they do have, like, dowries where you get, you, you do got to pay, um, you know, yeah. like, so the the family of the woman pays the family of the dude, I think. And I think they paid him to one day marry her. He just never did, but he took the money. So she like, yo, I need my money back. That makes uh, sense. Defending that himself in court, Herbert said yeah. this, the reason he had not yet proposed was because he did not have the financial security to pay for a wedding and argued that Gertrude had not been a dotting partner and had not given enough attention, given him enough That's attention. He was, he was out here in these streets. See? <laughs> hey, man, look. That's when you're paying for pussy go wrong. <laughs> this shit crazy, fool. That makes I mean, sense now, though. He tried to scam yeah, her now, ass yeah, and she now, said she now, wasn't having it. What the fuck going on? It's just he tried that. to scam her ass and she wasn't having it, fool. That's what it is. He tried to mm-hmm. run up on her. City boys, Facts. you lost. Facts. Yeah, we definitely lost one right there. Lil Duval would be sad. Now, nobody is more sad than Texas Longhorns coach. Oh, my God. Now, this the Texas Longhorns coach is stripper named Pole Assassin. Pole has, Assassin. This shit's silly, Has a monkey bro. and attacked the trick-or-treater. Now, there's a lot of shit going on in this. A lot of shit going a on. A lot here. of shit. Let's, okay. let's attack this. Let's, let's one, just piece this one piece at a time. One piece at a time. One piece at a time. So here. now we're going to start with uh, we're gonna, Tom Campbell here. I'm hearing a report from a credible source that Texas Longhorns special team coach Jeff Banks monkey monkey allegedly attacked the serious attacked and seriously hurt a young trick or treater last night on Halloween. The monkey's jaws apparently had to be pried out the small child. Mm-hmm. Let's scroll. Let down. me just stop right yeah. there, real quick. I'm, just, I'm gonna stop right there. Let me go in my piece. I'm not shocked that this happened because this has this has happened before. But some people bro, don't know what happened yet. Not what so, to play play. Bro. Some people don't know what happened yet. The long haul oh, just I'm hired Jeff it. Banks, who left his wife and kids to be with a stripper named Pole Assassin, who has been on the Jerry Springer and he, and has a pet monkey who is part of a stripping act. Wow. Now, diagnose. All what, right, what let you, me just yeah. start. Let me let me just start with the monkey first. All right, pet monkeys, bro. All right, like I mean, we we yeah. on this yeah. podcast have talked about in the past how yeah, yo yeah. they not the for play play, bro. Hey, like, hell, who is that? Fredo Bang, a young blue one boy that got a, a baboon. Nigga treat that. Yeah, he got a baboon. He thought he had a baby gonna... little pocket monkey. That bitch is a whole baboon, my boy. Yeah, shit, all oh, sweet they to the name, play, bro. They not for play. Like, why? Why are y'all still trying to? Uh, deme- I'm, I'm not sure what the the proper term yeah, is. Domesticate, like, yeah. domesticate these yeah. these wild animals, bro. Like, right? Stop it. Like, I, I just don't understand it. Like, y'all, like, right. chill out, fool. I just, no, I just see, don't it's, get that. It's it's one thing that. to like, I guess, like have a like have a pet monkey. I like it says we're, it's weird to say like pet monkey because monkeys don't operate like that. Like, you could coexist with a monkey. Like to a certain extent, and once they feel like, hey, bro, I'm tired of doing this shit, they gonna, you know, like they gonna, lady, they gonna mess with you. Period. They gonna, yeah, you know, bop your ass, and now, nah, nigga, I want my fucking bananas now. What's good? <laughs> Absolutely, like you can't, bro. They, they not. You can't. I don't care what you do. Like you can't train no monk unless you're in like a circus or something, bro. That's different, bro. But having like, a, like an a animal like that in your house, that shit is dumb right. to me. I, 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 right. I'm always. But listen now, we are talking about Austin, me. Texas here. No, you're right. You're right. They Where do shit different really out there weird. in Texas. It gets really weird out there in Austin, Texas. They do so, different shit in Texas. This is not okay. So, so I can we to. attack? Like, so what makes you want to leave your wife and kids for a stripper? Now we get into. The I mean, I can, I can, I can think of a few things. Let's, I mean, let's, no, let's, shit. let's spitball here. Let's but spitball that mean, here. But you got to be at the your wits end, done with your. That's whole what I'm saying. Life like because for you to leave your whole family to go be with a chick that has a whole monkey and she's shaking like, her ass out here. Like, no right. Like, like, was he like a? 
like a like a married man with like kids and shit. Where they they say he left his kids. wife and kids. His oh, left okay. his family. Yeah. I so mean, you know, like what? Like that's that's, that's not uncommon. That's, no, that's, no, that's, I mean, no, I, no, no, it's not uncommon. No, but to do, no, but to, this is to be, this kind of is though. You know, like, yeah, you know, as a you know, coach, you know, you gotta live by this. Uh, they do shit under the, the table, mode. like, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so being like being still being a married man and, and being a father to your kids and being the coach of these young kids out here, like that's looked as being like you you doing something. But if you leave your you wife said. and kids and then you go. You still want to be in the street, you know what I'm saying? Or you still want to just be young and you know whatever the fuck reason he won't decide. Yeah, yeah it don't matter to nobody because that ain't what you know the coach supposed to do. That's not what he's supposed to be. It's just like the same thing with the coach. With the, I will never forget the nigga that in Miami that was snorting the coke in the coach's office. It's like, I mean, Sheesh. I know his title like, is a coach, but he's still a human being, yeah. so he's still gonna do whatever the fuck, you know. But. I see what you're saying. Hey. I see what you're saying. He and plus he's he's, he ain't, he's he ain't not ain't supposed to do, do stuff First like of all, that. We shouldn't even have known this if it weren't for that dumbass monkey. <laughs> you're right. You're right. Like him getting the voice came out and moving on with his life. Was none about none of that shit would have came out if the, but the, the, the monkey if the girl that had a damn monkey. Yeah. yeah. I mean, you know what, fool? Like, damn. Now what's gonna go wrong I, is when he tell her, look, hey, we gotta get rid of this fucking monkey, bro. And she right. like, oh, yeah. oh no, Carlos stays with me. Because because now he's fucking with the money. Because now, that's part of the job. Exactly. So now like he, this nigga gonna be out there on his own ass. <laughs> ain't got right. to go. I mean, I'm overlooking at her page, bro. I think she's talented without the monkey. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. <laughs> no, that's yeah, fool, saying, but like man. she has some skill. And, and this just this right. just boosted her up. You know what I'm saying? Her race just went up. Her race this, just this is a, different now. Absolutely. This is definitely playing into her fucking favor because oh for sure what for what? sure he's winning right now. Yeah, she winning. For I mean, sure. like I'm sure that that they're gonna put that monkey down, but she can just go get like another monkey though. I mean, <laughs> I don't even know. <laughs> That's you never you know. know. They might not monkey. actually put the monkey down because she talking about some you know on the page. You talking about you saw a page? She said that the monkey was attacked first. <laughs> oh shit! So it's it's hey. It's, it's a whole. It's a whole first. situation. Yeah, it's a whole situation. Proved that the pole assassin monkey was actually the victim here. Stop. Okay, with the bro, witch. get out of here. Ain't no kids coming trick or treating and messing with your with your monkey, cuz. Right, they would. Oh, they got a she video mean. right here. That's crazy. What you mean they wouldn't? I'm look saying. Who, I'm saying like said kids, nigga. If a kid knocking on the door say trick or treat, bro, like I listen, I've I've man, seen trick or treat. Hey, First of all, ain't nobody getting inside of my man. house unless that monkey was outside that gate, the house. That, that gate was flimsy. It was as hell, outside boy. with the monkey. I'm sure see, they that were. gate. That gate was stupid flimsy. So if I am a little bad at kid, hey, hey, bro, that's a monkey over here, bro. You want to go fuck with that joint? Go get some candy. Bro, they crib is crazy. Though. Your, come crib on, bro, is he a crazy. coach, bro, in, at Texas. Nigga, bro, he he about? a special teams coach. Are they getting paid like that? Nigga, making three hundred. He in Texas. A year, bro. He in Texas. I, I'm just, I don't know. Dude. I'm just asking. She I mean, like, I know some coaches are not getting paid herself. like that. Yeah, you don't. No, no, no. Where you at, bro? You got to think about it. That's I'm how you in Texas. That's you in Texas. Yeah, right. you, you at you, University you of Texas, bro. Like, and you like, you can get you a crib in Texas for nah, big, not in Austin. Biggest shit for like pretty not cheap. In Austin, not in Austin. That's your tax in Austin. I mean, he probably not in Austin. He probably said that out in like the suburbs. No, he ain't. We don't, we don't know where my house is, I but I'm just saying it is. I'm telling you how coaches live in in, in, in the NFL, well, not NFL, in college, them folks down there. If that's for a fo- football period and you go move around, motherfuckers stay all in the same places, in the same areas down there. That's where yeah, it's like, the yeah. literally like 30 people that stay over here in the same part of place I stay at. So, niggas everywhere. But is that him right there? Ah, oh, damn. He was okay. at, that's oh, what I'm shit. saying. Okay, well, hell, like that's he already has the money. That's what I'm saying, bro. But that's Alabama, though, too, now. But this is this is what I'm telling you. You talking about oh how he you get right, it? He just right. I'm saying he's at these schools, but all these schools just like you talking about. All they got all that money to blow it. That, <laughs> these niggas get right, guaranteed you're right, you're contracts. Right. Yeah, you right. That nigga okay, can yeah. get fired tomorrow for the dumbass monkey. He's still straight. He gonna get a job in another eight months, six months. Yeah, <laughs> yeah this is true. This is true. So like, I wonder if matter, if him and his stripping wife gonna go to. I don't even think they married. Ah damn. So she can leave his ass for the bag at any time. That's crazy. Yep. 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 Yeah, That's so messed up, bro. 
Yo, it's, 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 a, it's, a, it's a sticky, <laughs> situ- it's a sticky situation, Alex. You know, Damn, you, bro, le- my you left lost. your family for a stripper and she might fuck around and leave you. Hey. The same way you got them? So Why are you losing? Yep. <laughs> right. That shit, why? Hey. But hey, shout out to you though, Alex. You got your uh got your podcast, as I recall, on the way, man. Y'all gotta make sure y'all tune in for that joint. When you all plan on dropping on what days and and, and bro, like, we dropping so on Tuesday. To Episode one is already out, bro. Yes, uh, Jasmine's <laughs> on there with me, man. It's real, real dope. Um Episode one got was out today. Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It dropped today on Tuesday. Today, it's on Tuesday. As I recall. That's live. That's live. As I recall. Appreciate that, man. Yeah, mm-hmm. y'all go support. Check the points out. We on Apple Music, Spotify, Face on the beat. You know what I'm saying? Raw Room Media Group, baby. We about to take over, man. Like we, no, we yeah, real deal, trying to expand, bro. I'm finna tap in for sure. For sure, for sure. Um, the uh, first two episodes already dropped, actually. So I got two out, actually. This is the first one that I kind of like just promoted. But the first one, conversation that um, I had with my pops about Roots <laughs> uh, and like, you know, just basically watching Roots back in the 70s when they didn't really even know about slavery at all. Like it wasn't taught in history books right. or anything like that at all. So like your first, so by this JC, you are in the ninth grade, right? 10th grade, ninth grade, 10th grade, right? Yeah, for sure. And it's in the seventies. So like you are, now you're going to school with a few white people, right? And in the history books, like yeah. slavery and all yeah. that is nowhere in the history books, nowhere. You just, your grandparents, right. that's all you know, right? But you, I technically say, okay, you know, I mean, I know about and I know, like, you know, yeah, they, they race, don't play you know about like the slavery. So you go home one day, oh, watch CBS or whatever the fuck channel it was on, and you see Roots. And niggas getting kidnapped from Africa, thrown off of the. That's sad. Technology. This nigga done froze. Hey, he was on the run, boy. That's no, yeah, that's how man. that's how it be. I mean, cause that's kind of how it is. Wi Fi. Like, we haven't been to the playoffs yeah, in over. Yeah, yeah that's crazy. Uh, like it's been crazy. a long time since we've been to the playoffs. So but yeah, y'all tune in, man. You know, right we there. can't really Alex expect right the games right there, just to be recall, fucking packed like that. Two, but they drop one two days. But they it's hope it get there. Two days ago for y'all. Uh, check it out. Um, yeah. Eddie George, you know Eddie George out here coaching, man. He had a coach in uh-huh. the, uh, we at Tennessee State. I like that shit too. That's big, and uh, but you know, they haven't been good in the past, you know, for a long time, and he been you know <clears throat> struggling trying to get, trying to get people out to the gates. You know, he had a look. He was disappointed by the TSU uh, home crowds and. Cody said, uh, we appreciate the it's fans gonna be, that support it's us. It's going to be. But it's discouraging when you see that because you don't have a real home. Right, it's going to be way live in, in their home the stadium, stadium in front of nobody. No, he's right. Um, I just have a few problems with, not him, but just the, the, the ways I know, I can say problems. But I just feel like there's ways that they can yeah. help this issue. One, not playing at Nissan Stadium where that bitch Capacity of sixty thousand. I mean, I don't, okay. I don't that like. Might help you. From, I don't even think you know, he expected to fill that bitch like out, but they still not gonna get fucking. You know, you have a ten thousand people in that bitch on campus. They're not gonna Legit. get. They're not gonna get that nice looking stadium. They got turf and everything. They don't play. That, uh, they don't they might get five. I might. don't know. Maybe somebody can tell us. But yeah, about to say uh, we'll 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 pull out. You know, an what I'm average saying? attendance. What was it like, Bates? Like, just re- yeah. So that's what you say, DB. I'm sure. Who? So yeah, man. I don't understand that. That's oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Second thing, uh, they just started winning, so people haven't been fucking. While with you uh, Facetime, I got a question, bro. What was it like, like playing in that game? Nah, what was it like, ho- like homecoming at LSU, homecoming at Auburn, Long like that time. week leading up to the game? What was that even like? Parties everywhere, shit. Nah, I feel yeah. He, he I mean, but I couldn't really tell you because nigga wasn't really winning. Will like, you participate? No, yeah, 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 in fact, you was at couldn't, part, he, couldn't participate. Had class and practice and man, stay Look, I, is it? <laughs> he said just more people came. 
Right. Right. Uh, no, Facts. You know, we, 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 that's what we said. You can't play at Nissan Stadium. You can't play in the NFL Stadium. Take that shit to your stadium on your campus. Yo. And make it look like that. You feel me? The band already going to take up half the, game? State, the section anyway. So, you know what I'm saying? Hey, you free parents out there, John, and you just try to find a way Eddie George can bring more people uh-huh. into that bitch, bro. Like, yeah, man. Yeah, just to have it in their home shit, that's the only way it could be better. <laughs> or you play in, in fucking Nissan Stadium, the... It's live. Longer. You'll be this nigga Darren ain't even recording. Well, undefeated, bro. You still not feeling up Nissan Stadium. I'm just, just, just being frank. Like, I mean, they not. Yeah, nah, they don't get no ten. Not in, nah, 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 nah. They need to be working on five. Yeah. Work on the Olive Brand South Panola game real quick. <laughs> Get that. Hey, Faye, hit that house a highlight clip. I'm going to make sure y'all, y'all boy listen to this real quick. All right. Oh, bro. I had to take a dookie because that sandwich. You might thought you know that, right? Huh? You might thought you know that, right? You might thought you know that, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hold on. Hey, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hey, nigga said, then nigga said. You know you yeah. might though. He was like, huh, huh? Like he forgot, but he was like, man. And the nigga nah, said, oh, bro. wait. Yeah. Yeah. He tried to lie. He was like, nah. Nah, I yeah. do. I do. I do. Bruh, that yeah. shit, bro, when I saw this shit, bro, I was just ain't I no way. Me, bro. He was a real friend, though, fool. Nah, he, he was, was real me. Friend. I Oh, yeah, he a real I would have kept on engaging like the conversation for real. Oh, what yeah. You gotta I do? Just, number one, I'm number two. If he was a bad friend, he would have been told telling everybody. Oh, Jeremy got a doo-doo. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Jeremy finna doo-doo on himself. <laughs> they got the age shit. That's why. That's so. what, bro, hey, he loyal, bro. Cause nigga, hey, then he could, he, and if you remember the end, he told him, hey, you, first of all, he was nine Thanks. years old. Why? <laughs> Bro, he what they body my dog? Oh, think about this shit. He mic'd up at old. nine years old. What the hell? Hey, I, I ain't even like, peep that, bro. You right, like, man, like, why y'all mic'd up for? What TV show is hell? this for? This, this <laughs> right, ain't what? for no. This gotta be for a YouTube channel. I it gotta, gotta be for a YouTube channel. A YouTube like hard knocks. Yeah, it's for, shit like that for, for, for kids. <laughs> this gotta be a five show knocks. though. Nah, they, you know, they already got that shit. They got uh, tykes. What that shit called? Um, Friday Night Tykes. Friday Night Tykes. I love that show too, by the way. Oh, okay. That's in a minute. This probably one of my favorite football shows, to be honest. It was kind of crazy. I, I, I want to say, I had... them cold. <laughs> I want to <laughs> say the, uh, the, show, the show Snoop had... Oh, is this the one? No, nah, this ain't so this ain't Snoop one. got a team, like they got a team. They had in Cali though, but like the 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 first Friday night tights was up in Texas. Yeah. They had like it was like it, it was, was like three squads. Yeah, yeah. Like the- yeah. Okay. Yeah, I remember watching the coach through, but this yeah, these young boys in football mic'd up and shit. That's crazy. I what? wish. Oh yeah, I wish. Now nah, there was this one kid on the um outlaws, I forget his name, bro, but he was cold. He was I forget his name. Leave. That man was cold. Like he's he's he'll he'll be in the league soon. Oh shit, damn, that's probably him right there. That kid from Oklahoma, that's probably him. Right. <laughs> that man was cold for him. I was like, damn, it was yes, Myzel Miller. That's him. That's him. That's him. That is him. Cold. Running back. Yeah, Sturski. All slap, purpose. Slap, slap. That man did everything. Ooh. Hey, you know the only thing I ain't gonna say not everybody, obviously, but some people it's crazy though. Like when they okay. play, when you play football so young, like eight, nine years old, like you max out at this age right here. Yeah, when you start too early, fool, you max like out. A lot of time. niggas that start like at this, at that young ass age, talking about doodling on themselves out there because they ate a sandwich. Like yeah. mm-hmm. the niggas that still babies, like the yeah. folks that when they get 17, 18, that's when they just. It can't get no better. They just, it's just over with. It's, they, they I was gonna ask like, you, like, why do you think that is? I mean, because like they still growing. And, like, I mean, feel why like, do you think they, they, they like, messed that at 17? I feel like a bunch of a bunch of them kids that be playing early on is playing like some of them is playing because they friend playing and they didn't really ever want to play, so they ain't never really try to get that good. 
You know what I'm saying? I like they, they parents probably want them to be out there. They don't even really care. Well, that's definitely like, you know what a saying? lot of that shit. It's, huh? defi- it's a, definitely a lot of that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, look, fool, there ain't no way you could really concentrate. That's the same. Yeah, that's the same. For development, too, to your point. Huh? I feel like there's like. I feel like just me, like being like a you know a regular consumer of football. I feel like there's just like no development. Like if if I feel like if like you are putting on pads and helmets that young, it's yeah. like I mean what and, and already like practicing hitting. It's like okay, you can't like like you just stunt my development. Like I'm already at that peak of wearing pads versus like right. like skill stuff like doing flag. I mean, you're just working on speed and agility. You know what I mean? Right. Like you get right. to high school. Mm-hmm. All right, now I'm about to work on like you know. Whatever you work on in high school, I think like obviously, you know what I'm saying like right, college. Right. I mean, it's 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 on, it's on, on set. You got to learn how to get hit and take a hit. And learn how to right, right, right. At yeah. A, at a older, I mean, I guess that's still better, but I mean, it's still good to learn. I mean, it's this, still good this, to learn any time where to do shit right. Yeah, the shit just crazy again. Like they in Pee Wee, they in whole formations and shit like that. Some of the kids don't even be paying attention. Standing, Nigga, I'm telling you, these folks don't pay no kind of goddamn attention. That's what I'm saying. Like they, that's so why they, you don't get the I, fucking ball. I literally, nigga. literally can't learn the game at that young. So it's like you got them out there doing that shit for weeks and weeks, and they, you know, six, seven years old. By the time they get 12, they don't want to go do that shit no more because they ain't even learning football. They just out there, fool. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Running around a nigga stiff arm me fall. Like, I don't want to do this no more. I'm not good. And I, also I don't think even really that, care to be good. That <laughs> like, social media, the coaches, the parents, they make it that these boys, they they feel like they got to be so good right there. And they're like, like, right, they mm. they push them kids too hard. For like, look at this. Like, that stupid shit right there. Coaches like, is fucking fighting and shit. He like, put this nigga in a headlock. And he let him, though. But he let him, though. And now he's yeah, now they throwing man. bows, fool. Now they throwing that's bows. Crazy. But like, that's what I'm saying. What? But like, that's what I'm saying. First, but like this. What the fuck is going uh, on? Right. Amateur. <laughs> imagine, look imagine at this nigga with the striped shirt. Talking about come here. Amateur sports. They the the people take it so far because one. Look at all right. those. Look at all those men bodies out there. Does it look like yes, any sir. of those gentlemen? Right, they all after not athletic grade, at all grade, at all. So they they have it in their mind that they were or are this good or like they their kid or no kid could tell them that they weren't or or was good back in the day. You feel me? That's why mm-hmm. they they can make them stories. I mean, you they can tell them, yeah, I, I blocked set fourteen niggas at one time. You know, you know what I'm saying crazy shit. Yeah, telling these dumbass stories. And, yeah, and then the saying. kids will believe it and be like, damn, I gotta be as good as. So and so, so a coach or my dad, I gotta be good at this person. And then going out there and trying to be as good and thinking they that, going on social media and doing all this and mm-hmm. having all these uh so, like I be seeing all these little high school and middle school pages, you know, all these kids and I just look at their comments and all they talking about, oh, they 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 this good, they as good as Odell Beckham and like I get it. You wanna be that. But I damn sure wanted to be Brian Dawkins, but I wasn't saying that school, hey, I am Brian right, Dawkins. Hey, nah, hell no. Nah. I was saying Fuck respect. No, I was, hey, I like that nigga's skill. I like, I wish I could play like that. I one day. Right, I, I, I wish feel, I could do hey, that, damn it. That was, you feel that me? was it. I should have worked then. So, I mean, so like, they say like, you do got a kid that's real passionate about playing though. So like, you got so a kid like that's passionate like about Kato playing. So like, Kato is passionate. Like, he hasn't played tackle yet, like, but he really wants to. Right. Like, <clears throat> so right now, he literally only learning about you're doing agility. Like, we do the ladder every time we go outside. Play. He always want to do ladder drills. He always want to do uh, backpedal drills and routes and so So he want to do that. But at the same time, he just want to sit there, watch YouTube, and ask questions. Like, why Jalen Ramsey playing like this? Why he doing it like that? Why he following this man around? Why he going in motion with him? Why he doing that's, Why is it third and short? Why is it da da da? Why, like, that's yeah, what that's, he likes to do. That's real interest in the game. And I, like, and that's, that's real why, interest. Yes, and that's why I have no problem with these niggas want to sit on YouTube for an hour and a half. Right, man, go mm. ahead, cause he finna come to me with one million questions, and I want him to ask me. I don't want him to ask nobody else. Nigga, don't ask <laughs> nobody else shit. I'm telling you, and I be telling him. I ain't told him so. Any day, uh, my son, future coaches, it's my fault. I told him, nigga, look, there ain't nobody gonna know <laughs> football like me. That's real. Right. That's, no, that's, that's, that's real. That's true. I, I told him, yeah. no matter what coach you have and you ever play for. They won't know more football than me. So he was like, So why don't you just all coach me at everything? I like, cause it's not gonna it might not work. So we ain't gonna, gonna work out, out like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We're not gonna try that, but we can always work out at home. We can always do stuff together, you know what I'm saying? Away from your team and your coaches. But 
You know what I'm saying? Oh, you just listen to me. If you got, if if your coach tells you, you something and it don't sound right, you hold on to it, bring it to me. We'll talk about it. If, if it ain't right, hell, I'll bring it to yeah. coach. And, and, yeah. And I ain't gonna be You know that. what's crazy though? Uh to your point, as far as like, you know, like maxing out, I feel like it's not only in football. I feel like it's in, it's in like, all you sports. See it in baseball and basketball. Especially it's in, in basketball. All sports. I feel like in basketball, you see it way more. When you got I think a it's kid way more. That's that's like tall, right? It's like he's tall in seventh grade, right? What does like a coach's inexperience do? Put his ass in the post, and he's six one. But you know he's six one in eighth grade. That's right. That, 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 now you said something right there, Alex. Now how stupid are AAU coaches? If you so fucking smart, you would have been putting this kid at point and at the two. Soon as they hit a long time ago, because in the NBA, it's for that's, the kids' development, that's though. It. That's the thing, because like it's it gonna be just, for the kids' development. So they want to win now. Even, they don't think even about the if future. he ain't even going even if he don't go to be six seven six eight, he only go to be six one six two. Now he gotta play the point where he his whole middle school and AAU high school career he been playing in the post, but now this mm-hmm. nigga he six, don't know how to he, dribble now. Now he only six one six two. Now he gotta mm-hmm. learn how to can't yeah, dribble. That's crazy. Can't think dribble about that shit. Damn. I seen a lot of kids. I mean, not even. I mean, like I just like I know people personally where I saw that. I mean, heck, mm-hmm. it was like I feel like I was considered tall back, and I was in like eighth no, yeah, grade and are. stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. You know yeah. What I'm saying, but I, but like we had some taller dudes on my squad, but they was they was only like six two, six three. Uh-huh. Right, and it right, grow right. anymore after that. Yeah. So when they got to high school and like. Dudes were hitting that real growth spurt, the like real shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's like, no, you're not, you're not, you're not posting up a dude that's six seven two plus, uh-huh. and you six three. You need to be held the rock. Yeah, you feel sure. me? But like a lot of like, I feel like in basketball like that. I feel like even in baseball, when you put these kids in fast pitch in little league, mm. they throw their arm out before they even develop. Mm. I ain't even think about that. No, but yeah. like I feel like that's like a parent thing, and like to your point to what you said is like you know coaching your own kid the right way yeah. because a coach for a team will have your kid messed up because they don't think about their win today. They're not thinking about developing these kids uh, anymore. I, at least I feel that way. Anyway. I feel I like mean, not, not, not really even just the coach, like even these people. trainers out here. Some of these trainers, them niggas ain't talking about shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Them folks yeah, hey. be out there doing bullshit. Yeah, I would. I was about to say it's some of. Uh, uh, I say a good bit of the shit is on the coach, you know, not putting their kids in the right position. But at the same time, a lot of these parents, because they not athletes themselves, they, they don't, don't know, know how to put their kid yeah. in a good position. You it's know like lottery. It's like the lottery to them. It's like the lottery to them. They, they like, oh well, shit. I believe. I would believe my yep. kid, and I yep. think he's good enough, so yep. he should be out there. Like, yeah, bro. You, don't know what's fucking going. Pushing your kid to do this, he don't even want to play this. He want to. He want to go play that. Like that's why all I types to, of that's shit. That's why I have to be watching myself around Kato when I, like I be talking about them college, high school probably, but that nigga garbage ahead. Of <laughs> but <laughs> but <laughs> he be he ask me like he that, that got good and I really, and I be really thinking like before I answer, I will be talking to myself thinking like man, that nigga so sorry, bro. Right, you just talking like from from your and from, from your mind, yeah, and I be a, saying that shit out loud. Right, like, I know this might be taking notes and be like, I know he's saying that shit at school. Like, bro, you sorry as hell. <laughs> I know he do, bro. Cause he be telling me <laughs> hey, how boo. he tell he be telling me how I was like he was saying something about some kid that maybe yeah I told you he was oh, I was telling my dad my sister I was like he tell me how they be playing talk some more bust more they call that shit something else though. <laughs> no, he was just talking about how he was in there. Oh, he, you know, he finally got tackled. Oh, he now he had tackled some kid. We was, he was like, well, I hit him so hard, but bro, I was like, well, shoot. Like, what you do when you get the ball? You be getting hit? He was like, yeah, sometimes, but a lot of times they miss. I was like, ooh, okay. <laughs> he said a lot of times they miss. <laughs> get saucy on the head, dude. Yeah. I was like, okay, he learned how to get, you know. Playing with some get kids, jiggy. getting hit and shit, yeah, getting really playing football. They might really want to be Jalen Ramsey though. They might really think he'll corner. He think he he want to be Tyree Hill or Jalen Ramsey, bro. So, hey, man, man, that's he's a receiver or a corner, huh? Yep, that's all. That's lie. No, nah, he want to play running back though. But I was mm-hmm. like, you know, they begin here, right? <laughs> he was like, yeah, that's all right. Yeah, all right. He, he he just see he just see the shine. That's how he sees. That's how, yep. He's, he just see the score touchdown. He see the shine, and shit. He getting up to my first down. You got three yards. Sit down, dude. Right. All right, fool. Thinking about uh, th- like back to the celebrations, but I was just looking at like just different people celebrating over the weekend. Um, what's the cat name uh for the Cowboys? God damn it, CD Lamb. See- that might be yeah. like whenever whenever he get it first down, it should be lit. I, I like I this. Know, I it. Should lie. 
<laughs> bro, they make it first time. They do like their little. Oh, the little, oh, hell nah. <laughs> bro, <laughs> they they live. Those, nigga. <laughs> this yeah, shit live, wife, bro. Wife this shit live. Loves. It's live. He got fine. Like that shit. He got fine. Oh, yeah, yeah. Bring, up, oh, yeah. bring up his fine shit. Now, listen. Yeah, people know that. Nah, nah. Okay. Actually, well, yeah, nah, we didn't talk fact, about I ain't even talk about that shit. You know what? Hell no. Nah. <laughs> nope. Go what you got. Nigga, I'm, I be snitching on myself. Hell <laughs> no. Nah. I ain't even talk about none, nothing. Nothing. That nigga's yeah. fine. Whatever he did, they, they ain't got nothing to do with me. Listen, moving on. Uh, drug kingpin <laughs> Alpo, you know that Alpo. Made a business decision, man. You fucking right. Hey, I, I, I business like this, business business decision. Decision. but I like the shit they let me get away with. So hey, I'm gonna keep yeah, on okay. going. Hey, right. I ain't even talk about right. nobody's socks. Um, y'all wanna get straight to the to the? Uh, nah, one business thing. Business hold on, stuff. you seen paid in full, right? Everybody seen paid in full. Absolutely. And you knew it was a true story, right? Yeah. I ain't really know what it was like it was like factual fact. They changed yeah. the names, right? Well, obviously Rico. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, Alpo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you know, yeah. you know, Alpo ended up killing um his um own friend, own uh business partner, uh, and went to prison for a while. His own business partner, rich and friend, Rich Porter, uh, just all for the name in the name of drugs and money. And uh, you know, he was locked up for a while. And then he was on witness protection. Mm-hmm. Bro, brother, got out and shit. Bro, I guess this brother decided he gonna go to a party. And he went back to the hood. Fool. Went back to the hood. He had a little mask on. Then he gonna go to a Halloween party and they wet his ass up. Now, this, you know what this reminds me of? Remember yeah. Griselda Blanco? Someone mm-hmm. that's like, got out and went back home. <laughs> Same shit happened to this nigga. I mean, but like, bro, what what does he expect? Like, bro, bro you got fourteen people game. killed, nigga. He killed four deep people. in the drug like game, kids and all, bro. The nigga snitched on a whole bunch of people. That's what I'm saying. Like, for you, deep and you snitch, fool, and then you just expect to go back home like these peaches and like 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 nothing happened, like nothing. Peaches happened. And, like what? Dude, nah, shit, fool. come on, like man. motherfuckers that's, that's been not... sitting in that shit for what? What has been like thirty some years for like? Bro, motherfucker been waiting for you to, like, just waiting for you That's to slip up. That's what I'm saying, fool. Like, like waiting for you to slip up one time. Y'all, they, and it you were protected one. for most of this time by the government. Facts, facts. And <sighs> them folks out there don't give a fuck about the government. They be sitting, Man, festering with that waiting. shit. They were waiting, fool. Waiting. Constantly. They said, oh, I mean, yeah. I, 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 I would say, like, maybe, like, the reason why he did get out is because, honestly, being in witness protection is just like being in prison. You can't do shit. It's like, bro, fuck this. I, I want to go outside one time. And it, it, yeah, that one time costs his ass. All right. Yeah. All right. Yeah, look. That one time one, costs him big One time, time shit. And apparently, though, they said uh, he had tossed some drugs out of his truck window following shooting. I don't know. I don't know if that's... He tossed drugs out the car following yeah, shooting. I don't even know how that's, that's Vlad. You know, of course, sometimes you can't depend on Vlad. Vlad, you know... Shady sometimes. Yeah. That's some what? Vlad like, what? is sometimes shady. So that's why I kind of stopped not, watching Vlad after a while. I used to fuck with Vlad, but then. Yeah, because yeah. I'm like, if I, I get shot. Cloud chasing a little bit. Yeah, if yeah, I get a little sh- too much, bro. Like, yeah. And then I just started, I thought he was trying to use Boosie too much. Like, he used Boosie like every goddamn week for some shit. I just yeah, like Boosie do be. Yeah, he, yeah, he, yeah, he just. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Oh, yeah. Let's get in this uh <clears throat> mail room real quick. Did you want serious. to uh, touch on a serious topic? I'm gonna leave that alone for now. What you going? What you got serious? Huh? The uh, the incident that happened in Vegas. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. What Damn. You, what you, uh, I mean, bring the driver. I mean, shit. I mean, we all know that hey, that is not the way to go. That's not how you. Smoke it is weed, not bro. not the way to go, ladies like, and gentlemen. No, I mean, I, I hate that for that man. Everybody, but... they, everybody that's a part of the shit, like. I feel bad for him, the, the victim, mm-hmm. the families on both sides. You know what I'm saying? It's a, just just an unfortunate situation, fool, but it's and like- And it, it, it kind of made me upset because like, damn, young nigga, like, you know how you know, I many people were depending on you now? Like That's what I'm saying, you fool. You know you can't up. No, you can't drink and drive, fool. Come on. And you, you in Vegas, that, bro. Fool. There's so many ways. They prevent you, like, keep it. There's so many I'm ways you can- saying. They have Uber. Too they got taxis. They have drivers. They- but you can. It's so easy to get a driver in Vegas. So easy, bro. 
Fool, yeah. I didn't slept in my car in Atlanta because I was too fucked up to drive. Oh, but I, I said, that's Fuck just, it. yes. Fuck it. Yeah, I'm, I'm them doors. Right here. I'm gone, bitch. Facts. I just I, feel like, too, man, like, it's just one of those things where if if you around certain people, I, th- I feel like certain people just shit. If you go, look, prime example, bro, like, when, when like, we was all out in Miami, fool, you know what I'm saying? Kicking it. Yeah. I made a point. I said, yo, yeah, yeah. I'm not going to drink. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'll be DD. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'll drive around. I got y'all. Y'all turn them to y'all think. I just, I just feel like everybody, especially when you high profile, like how, you know what I'm saying? How yeah, you got to have high profile. And yeah, you got to have somebody like that on your, on your squad. State, like you live, I mean, you, 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 yeah. you at the, you know what I'm saying? You in Vegas. A trainer, somebody. No, nah, you ain't got to It's just 30,000 people in car before that. You 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 could get somebody to drive you or fucking call a Uber, goddamn like fuck. Yeah. Just come back and get the whip, fool. You got the key, lock that bitch. Like, mm. damn, fool. That shit is not it's what sad. you want to see, fool. Not at all. It's not sad. for it's anybody, sad. fool. Not for anybody. And like I said, I've I've been seen to me. I, I I just feel like you know even. You know, like we we all dumb done some dumb stuff. Heck, like oh, back abs- in the day, absolutely. You know, when like when like we was coming up, I mean, Uber wasn't around, so yeah. it was like you know either somebody was gonna be a DD or we did take that chance. Like right. I, I mean, I do remember like there have been some time we took that chance, but it was one night where you know what I'm saying one well, of my homies took that chance. This shit did not end right. You know, I was right. like, oh, fuck. After that, it's like yo, we are gonna have to figure something else yeah. out. But nowadays, yeah, not, yeah. the point there's options, bro. Lock your shit up, you know. Call the Uber, but there's been plenty of nights in Nashville, bro, where I left my car at the weekend or left it at Limelight. And I yep. said, bro, I'll just come back and get this shit tomorrow, fool. Right. You know what Got I mean? Got to. Plenty Got of nights. To. I just, I'm going to leave the whole right there. It, it'll it'll be there, you know? It definitely will, fool. Prayers up, mean, though. Yeah, prayers up. Yeah, definitely, that. definitely, fool. I mean, <clears throat> sheesh. Hey, uh, the yeah, man, so mail good. room, uh, <clears throat> our nigga Clarence asked, he said, uh, Jalen, if he if he have a, se- a solid season up north, you're gonna try to get back in the league. Uh I feel like he's yeah. 100 percent healthy. I'm about to... <laughs> Nigga ain't gonna I pass say, out. I say I anybody can answer that question. Why would I not go back? <laughs> yes. <laughs> what? <laughs> did Jay- I'll answer that for Larry Bird, Zach Morrow. Uh did JC and DB try and mirror their games? Like, hey, um, I feel like we just answered that shit basically without even. But see, I want to say we talked, we, we might have talked about that before. Fool. Oh, no, I was talking about even just this episode. Uh, uh yeah, like just earlier. True. Uh, like anyone as they grew up, uh, I'm not sure track athletes do, but ask Alex too. LOL. Yeah. <laughs> Did you want to run like somebody? Alex. No, I mean, and nigga, I, I was a, but I was trying to hoop for yeah, so I know. Nigga, nigga just end up running. I, thought, well, fuck. <laughs> I guess I'm gonna run track now. <laughs> <laughs> hey, nah, I ain't really, I ain't really like mirror my game after nobody. Like, yeah, I see niggas cold. I see, you know what I'm saying? All these DBs doing their damn thing. Everybody different shit. Everybody out there balling. So shit, I'm going to just do it how I doing it. They all doing it how they doing it. Yeah. Fuck. I but I did, that. I did, I did fuck with, uh, with Larry though. Fitzgerald, you know, the dreads hanging out the back of him. I did like I that feel shit. You. Oh, I feel you. Okay, let me. Mm-hmm. Oh, it was just swag for you. See, that, me, too, yeah. oh, yeah. swag. me too. Me too. It was yeah. swag. Like I, oh, like I said, Brian Dawkins. But I thought whoever next. I thought he was the coldest safety, coldest football player. But I, I went out there trying yeah. to hit like weapon next because I won two thirty. You feel me? I'm one sixty five, baby. So I, yeah. I'm tackling like I know how to tackle. <laughs> but I'm in my mind. I just did it just like him. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna have the same swag, the dark visor, all that shit. Oh, my back growing up, my I, I wouldn't say. Like it was a person, but I want to say like Texas when they when Vince Young was there, yeah, and the, they DBs that they had, bro, all all they DBs was five food, all of them, they, for sure, all of them, and they had to sweat the the long the, the long yeah, the like long, four yeah, sleeve the, the, with, yeah, with the, the one band, giant. yeah, with the one, it, yeah, it came all, three quarters and then yeah. the band food, yeah. that shit was hard as that was fuck, the, that was the style then, bro. Hey, that man. was the shit, fool. Yeah, that nah, boy, they is, had that boy was the, nice out there. Mike Griffin. Yeah. Uh, oh, the Griffin Brothers, fool. They uh, was going crazy. They and uh, what's his nigga name? Earl Thomas. No, nah, I, bro, I'm, bro, I used to watch this shit, play this shit on uh, NCAA. <laughs> they didn't have the names on the game, so I don't. Yeah, I remember yeah. the numbers and shit. <laughs> they definitely had no names on that bitch. From uh, Colton, Crane Milk. Crane Milk, fuck him. He always around, man. Been a roommate for a long time. What was the best Halloween uh, candy growing up? I mean... Man, that's hard. See, for, for me, it has, it has and always will be probably Reese's. 
That's that's the number one candy I was looking for in my bag. Shit, it's it's a with. it's a cup. It's one cup or two cups, bro. How y'all coming? One yeah. cup or two cup. What's good? Hey, I ain't, I'm ain't not mad at that. that. Yeah, I'm not mad at that. Really? I like all the fruity candy though, like Skittles, Starburst, like you know that type mm-hmm. of shit. Mm-hmm. It's easy for me to pick the ones I didn't want to fuck with. You know what I mean? Oh, you know, yeah, yeah. What, what did, what didn't you want to see in there? It was a plan, bro. Oh, so check this out. Shit, I, I was in my one of my offices today, fool, and somebody actually tweeted this. So you remember like back in the day when like our parents used to check out candy and stuff, to make sure they weren't like no razor blades in and shit like that. Uh-huh. Yeah, no bullshit. So I'm talking to, I'm, I'm in my one of my offices today, and she was like, you know what? I feel like our parents were slick getting over on us because they had they'll like check our bags. Mm-hmm. Oh, I feel like the reason why they was checking our bags so they was getting I all this good shit out. Nah, did you not know that, just, that today they just found this? I don't know what social media shit put it out, but they just found a needle in a Kit Kat. A needle That's in wrong. the Kit Kat? Like a pin needle, like a sewing needle. Somebody put that shit in the Kit Kat. See, what fucking wrong with folks, fool? So yeah, yo, I'm gonna keep it a buck. I'm gonna keep it a buck. I'm gonna play devil's advocate. Uh, I think that's fake. Hey, hey, it could yeah, be, you know what? I would, I would, I would, I would probably. I the would. reason why, the re- I listen, saying, I listen. Totally the reason it. why, the reason why, because if a kid opens it up, uh-huh. right, ain't no parent checking each individual Kit yeah, Kat and the Kit Kat bar, candy. bro. They no, not opening the candy. You want they right. they are biting into that joint and Facts. that joint is like they actually took their piece off, oh, bro. That's say, fake, look, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, hey, listen, I'm not saying that it happened. I'm just saying people out here saying that it's happening. That, that's <laughs> I'm fake. not saying that, but people out here saying that it's still happening. And they should hey, look, CNN, bro. But, that, but my friends, thing is just like, shit. but my thing is just like, how do you, how do you not see that this candy is open wrapper? Like that's what I'm saying. Right. Or something. So even if I see that hell open, I'm not even gonna go that far to even see that part. I'm, if I see it open, I'm just throwing the hell away. Anyway. Yeah, I'm just throwing yeah, it's, away. It's, yeah, it's, like, it's, it's over. Like, I don't even know how it got open, but I ain't give a fuck. Hey, you might not need I'm to open that sure. one though to stick a needle in it. Just stick a needle on the top or some shit. I feel you. Yeah, I mean, true. like you can. I feel yeah, you. But true. like at the end of the day, though, look how it's open up, though, Faye. Like they had to open this this they one like particular kick out bitch, up. Yeah, it's like they, they to took find a knife and got that bitch out. Yeah, it's like, come on now, man. Like, if a needle was really in it, the kid would have been into it. I, yeah, I, I, I need to see, like, some... And, and I need it would have like been some, poking out at the top. Yeah, I need to see some some teeth marks or something, man. Yeah. <laughs> or something, like, did. make that, like, convince me a little harder than that. <laughs> and, like, bro, I've been hey. eating candy for a while. For no, yeah, definitely. Ain't, nobody, I, ain't no shit been in my shit. If I see some shit, like, looking weird on the candy food and I had already opened it, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a break that bitch or something. I ain't gonna like slice that bitch open yeah, like that. Bro. That's that's let me, precision. Let me let me let me, let me slice it open. Let me slice. No, nah, I'm gonna be like, like, hold on. Let me see what the fuck going on with this shit. Yeah, no. Nah, but man. still, parents protect your kids though. So don't don't listen to me. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I didn't this shit. Brandon though. Barnes, I Coach Barnes. What makes a good locker room? I mean, a lot of shit. It's a it's a lot. It's DJ a lot. Who no, it's not it's a lot that. that goes into making a good locker room. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. Shit, well, give give us some. Y'all being vague. I mean, hell. shit. You can't, like, but I'm what? saying you can't just be like it's it, it's it, it's like give me like the top five. Top five. There's top no five. Thing. I mean, it's well, one. It's got to have some type of structure, fool. It's got to have you. some type of discipline. Like niggas just can't be. Wow. Dirty as fuck. Yeah. The clothes can't be it. it you uh-huh. can't leave shit can't everywhere. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, the, it can still be, be stealing in the NFL. Not in NFL everywhere, but everywhere. But so I'm about to say, like, like, y'all getting paid. Uh, y'all nah, still nah, stealing. Nah, but still, nigga, there's other people that work here that don't that don't get paid like that. Like in All the right. Rams, we had a situation where niggas getting their phones stolen out of their locker, and it wasn't nobody obviously on the team. It was a that's challenge. Right. Kid. It, just, it be it, that's what I'm saying. It, but you gotta have some type of like structure and discipline in that bitch. That's number it can't one. Can't be dirty. It can't be dirty. It, it, it gotta be some rules. It gotta, it gotta be structure. Because then if you disrespect them, the knock on that means you disrespect the equipment to uh, staff. Exactly. It's you gotta be. Saying? It's gotta be you structure and to the, rules. To the general lady that come up in here and backing in this flow, get up out of the grass mm-hmm. off the flow. But you got right. your shit still laid out on the flow, and equipment people tired of you laying your shit out, so they just say fuck it. They, they can say right. tomorrow they gonna you leave it dirty down. loop, nigga. Ain't gonna right. leave this shit here. 
But now right, they, they not they, watching your you shit me? no more because you gonna be an asshole. You feel me? Now your shit stink. And the next next morning, niggas hot when they walk in because this four five niggas that's by your locker, that shit smell like ass. And, you know what I'm saying? And sweat. Right. Like, yeah, right. a whole bunch of shit. Ass sweating balls. You was about to say balls. I was about to say it. some doo doo or some shit. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> nah, there's a lot of shit, man. All right, okay, okay. So like, it gotta be clean. I think like the the music gotta, the music gotta play like a little vibe. It gotta vibe. be some music in there. It gotta be some type. Yeah, it gotta of fun, be some music. Game, it does. Pong, it does have to be table, music. basketball. Uh, uh, maybe dice game. Some. It's gotta be some type of activity going on. Yeah, it, it, it's still some, shooting dice in the locker room. Hey man, look, I don't know nothing about them. <laughs> hey, no, nah, I mean, and look, everybody different, but you know, it what it is. Like it, niggas got to be able to. Yeah. Like, bro, y'all remember able back able to... in high school? Full, we used to shoot. Well, I don't know about y'all. Like, I, nah, bro, we, we used definitely to shoot shooting dice. High school. What? My <laughs> niggas, was, was, niggas was a wild. Doing, I'm, like I'm talking about niggas just going to the bathroom just to shoot some dice, bro. <laughs> just shoot dice. That was a wild time, bro. Wow. That was a wild time. We used mm-hmm. to play quarters. Remember? Uh, nah, nah, nah. Yes, not quarters, nigga. Uh, we used to play. Yeah. Get like me. Yes, bro. <laughs> you remember get like me? Bro, everybody used to be on them stupid ass games, bro. Stupid little games, bro. Just take niggas lunch money and shit. Just bet <laughs> they little four five dollars, nigga. Like they no money over here, nigga. None. But uh, oh what we got uh, T N. Somebody JoJo. said about the um. Thoughts somebody on the Colin oh, Kaepernick Netflix series. Yeah, I was about to say. Ain't that. watched it yet. I'll, I watched it tonight. I'm gonna check it out tonight. Rabbit just tw- uh put on his IG. Uh, Rabbit just said that it's it's the best thing on Netflix. So I oh, said, damn, okay, it well, shit, it must be hidden. I'm finna call that nigga see if he tomorrow. Yeah, they might, they might put that joint, but yeah, uh, he said he said it's like the best thing on Netflix. I ain't gonna lie to you, I was slick, skeptical, clicking on it, fool, because I was like, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna click on it. I'm gonna click on it. I'm gonna wait to call this nigga. I'm gonna watch. We gonna watch it then. We gonna call that nigga. Bet, so yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna check it out though. But yeah, uh, he he uh, he uh, said that it was straight. I said, all right, bet. I'm gonna go ahead and check that joint out tonight. I'm, I'm gonna check it out tonight. Uh, okay. I started Dope Sick too, by the way. Oh man, I can't wait. And what show? What episode are they on now? It's still on fire. Uh, I, I think it come out on Tuesday. So I think like they gotta uh, be on seven, six, six, six. I think it's tonight. Yeah, last week I watched all them hoes. Crazy, Bruh, me too. Crazy, I watched man. them. I was like, ooh, cool. got me. Nick, hooked. I'm talking about hooked. Hooked. I'm all up on some dope shit. Like I ain't like we ain't living in the shit right now. We watching these niggas literally go through the shit. Yeah, let's move it. Bro. It's on yeah. Hulu. I might have to check this yeah, out. I did Hulu. see it's that. Crazy, check it, bro. Yeah, I did I see that the other day. Gotta check it out. It's, it's fire. It got me. I'm hooked. And they you finish a BMF? Yeah. Are you caught up on BMF? Absolutely. Hey, that nigga Lamar yeah. is insane. Yeah, but yeah, bro. Lamar different. Bro, that might kill any. That nigga kill kids. Yeah, spoiler alert. <laughs> oh yeah, you don't oh, know what. I'm kid. glad I wasn't listening. I'm glad I wasn't. You listening. don't know Mr. what kid spoiler though. Alert. You don't know what kid. Yeah, though, so. but nah, that might. But uh, bro, you know, Meech was in Memphis a couple of weeks ago at a part. Had a party in Memphis. Little Meech. Yeah. Damn, for real. <laughs> they had a fly and everything. <clears throat> bro. I didn't go. I was like, I, I, I wouldn't go to. I wouldn't feel safe at that party. But no, I, I'll let y'all have that. Bro, you know, every gangster nigga was out there. Bro, they Absolutely. heard little Meech was coming. Yes, bro. Might as well say like, Big Meech was coming. Yes, yeah, might as well. Oh, yeah. For real. Might as well. I mean, right you, now the nigga is Big Meech. That's the closest right you, that's close you, you gonna get to the re, to, to the real Big yeah. Meech. You know what I'm saying? But sheesh. But yeah, that man was in Memphis. Let me see if I can find that. Hey, you would think you would think little Meech out here really like running. Like, I mean, he probably is running BMF. Whatever they got going, I'm sure some legal operation they got going on these days. But, <laughs> he said legal operation. <laughs> but I'm just saying, as yeah. far as you know, the man got the chains. That man, hey, he be fresh. I don't know if he. And it seemed like he just got on the ground, bro. Like when the show came. Yeah, yeah. So, that might, that might, that might probably be, you know, you know what I'm saying, bro. But like, listen, I've, I've, I've been seeing the man on a. Uh, on a Twitter and IG, it's like, yeah, this like he's a normal street dude. Yes, I am. <laughs> he's Sheesh. just a normal street dude, bro. For real. Yeah, <laughs> bro, I'm over here talking to you about dogs and podcasting at the same time. Talk about great podcasting skills. Mo- <laughs> <laughs> uh, that man, that man was out with Goo Wop before. 
Like, look, me has been around, bro. Me has like, been he, around, he, man. He been doing him off yeah. thing, bro. Shout out to him. That show is amazing. Danny to get the man on the podcast. Man, for real. Shout out to him, little Meech. You know what I'm <laughs> I know your room, mate, bro. Fuck with us. Hell yeah. yeah. Come holler at us, little Meech. See, what we got? Got anything else? Uh, nah, I don't know. Gucci. Yeah, yeah. See, it, uh... Should I be in Memphis? Well, shit, I ain't gonna tell people I'm gonna be this weekend here. Yeah. Well, I'll be in New Orleans. Uh, anybody got any <laughs> food recommendations for your boy? I only played in Thanks. New Orleans, I wanna say like once, maybe twice. Um, you know, I know Dion, Dion Jones, you know, he's from there, so he gonna, he told me about yeah. some shit. So I'm probably Debo gonna, gonna get you there. right. Yeah, yeah, I'll probably just go with him because. Oh, we was at Miami. We wanted to eat good somewhere. She was delicious. We and now, de- definitely, out. definitely go with Debo. He know that. He know that nigga. I need. You know that crazy ass nigga, funny ass bro. Hey, big week for for the raw room though, man. We got playoff ball oh, starting me. up in Canada. We got hey, the, uh, we got the as I recall podcast dropped today. So you go ahead, scoop that shit up. Make sure you listen and get that listen in right before or after you listen to this episode. Uh, appreciate everybody tuning in. You already know what it is. Yeah, Easy. Sir. If you have something to say and need a place to help you say it, check out the boys at the Raw Room Media Group to get information on recording the session. Appreciate y'all for listening. Hey, follow us. Follow us at the Raw Room, Twitter, Instagram. Follow me at Wesson underscore Sun56 on Instagram. On Twitter, DB underscore 5 Trey. Follow your boy, JC. Uh, Jcar underscore 11, Twitter, uh, Instagram, Jcar underscore 32. Uh, and the, the raw room is at raw underscore underscore room. Roomies, we appreciate y'all for listening. Yeah. We'll tune in for your next week. Easy. Easy.